Hi, I'm Kate. Welcome back to my channel. Today we're going to start a new spring series and I'm going to start with Plum Blossom. Let's get started. I'm going to start with the eye first. For the Japanese white eyed bird, as suggested by name, there is a white circle around the eyes. Green is the key tone of this painting. The natural green is a mix of yellowed and blue. You may adjust the color to the tone you like, from lime green to more blue. You can also add a bit of ink if you want it to be dark green. For the wings, I've added a bit of ink before I paint, so there is a bit of grayish color. The chest is a bit of yellowed and orange color. You can add a little bit of red if you want it to be more dynamic. Plum blossoms have five round petals. They are white, green, pink, and red color. I like these green ones because they just look more elegant and different. I'm painting a few small clusters of flowers first. In Chinese watercolor, it is difficult to paint over the first layer of color. So you have to plan and figure out what you want to be shown on the foreground first, and then build up the background. I know that I haven't done any draft, but I did it on my hat. It is in my mind. I visualize it before I paint on the paper. Of course, there are some failures, and that's part of the learning process. And that's how I create my painting. Now I'm using ink to paint the tree branches to connect the plum flowers. I'm doing it very slowly with caution because I want to make sure that they really are connecting. And also where I'm gonna continue to extend the flowers. So I'm thinking while I'm painting. Okay, now I'm painting the pistols with just ink. Since I've painted so many flowers, I have to look carefully where the flowers are. It is easy to be some.
And now I'm painting the feet of the bird. Don't forget that. And I'm going to add some splasher. If you want to paint something like cherry blossoms or plum blossoms, I think that this is one of the good techniques to add to the painting because then you can imply that there are many more instead of trying to paint all of them. Thanks for watching. I hope you like this video. Please subscribe if you haven't already and turn on the notification button so that you don't miss out any updates. I'll see you in my next video.